Good afternoon, and thank you for allowing me to talk to you about this job, working as a quality assurance representative at VTAV here in Point Magoo. Just a little bit about myself. My name is William Roberson. I worked in Naval Aviation Maintenance for the last 10 years. And over these last 10 years, I've had the opportunity to work in different places, on different ships, working on different platforms. I have backgrounds in both FA-18s and fixed wings, as well as working on rotor aircraft such as the H-60s and the MQ-8B Fire Scout. Um, as I've talked about, since this office itself works on Fire Scouts such as the Bravos and Charlies, I feel like my qualifications help put me in a good place for this because it allows me to step in and create a smooth process considering that I already know the uh, platform is very well and will be able to create a smooth transition into the company. Over the last few years, I have had the opportunity to work with the Helicopter Sea Combat Squadrons here on the West Coast and as well as the East Coast. I have gone on multiple attachments with this platform as well as a deployment and have used this aircraft in every role that it is designed to do with a very high completion rate of sorties. Um, for my academic side, I've just recently finished my bachelor's degree with Trident University and I have completed my airframe and power plants qualification with the Department of Labor, allowing me to be certified to work on commercial aircraft. Now, now that we've talked about my qualifications able to do the maintenance side and shown that, I've also attended multiple leadership courses during my time in the Navy, and I've been placed in supervisor roles that have put me in charge of 15 to 20 people at a time, conducting maintenance on multiple different aircraft at the same time. Being in the supervisor role has helped me to grow a lot, and it also helps me to take any position within the company here at V2AV. One of my better accomplishments with working with outside people, such as we do all the time, is when we were working on a modification on one of our aircraft, we were in contact with engineers from Cherry Point, engineers from the field office here in San Diego, and representatives from FRC here, as well as the program office in Jacksonville. During that time, I was able to coordinate with all these groups of people on the the standing of the aircraft they were doing on it and give them updates on our side that we were able to control and things that would still need be required. During that time I was able to track issues that were not brought up. I was able to keep that issue fixed before it, it came time to need it. In closing, I feel like I would be a valuable asset to this team not with not only my hands-on experience with the aircraft, but my leadership side as well. Thank you, and I hope you recommend me for the position.